back to the MDN Bank Alder Grove. Talking about money brings up a lot of shame, but I want to see people go from being embarrassed to being empowered. They have nothing to cheer about. Overspending on stuff like this is what got them in trouble in the first place. It's time for you to seriously reevaluate your spending. But the recreational sports items, video game consoles, and those large flat screen TVs we know you all have. One big screen TV, sure. But some of these people have three or four, and they are maxing out their credit cards to get them. Last week, we asked you to get rid of things you didn't need and that you couldn't afford. Some of you struggled with this challenge, and a number of you exceeded your own expectations, and also our own expectations, so great job, everyone. Now, last week, you did an amazing job and raised a total of $137,515. And if you've reached your million dollar goal, you'll have earned the right to vote for one family who will receive the life-changing amount of $100,000. This week, we're going to reinvent and revitalize them. To help the community define and achieve their business goals, we have a very special challenge in store for them. One that's hopefully going to help them hit the $100,000 mark this week. Living within your means is key, no matter what your income is. I have heard about your home. <laughs> I would love it if you could give me a tour. We do have a huge mortgage. Wow, this is gorgeous. It's a big house. It's probably more than what we need, but it was it's a good deal and we went for it. It's now time to find out if you reach this week's goal of increasing your collective net worth by $100,000. For the past seven weeks, Aldergrove has been making repairs to their financial lives in their quest to become the Million Dollar Neighborhood. This week, we're taking it to a whole new level. You've all heard the expression, home is where the heart is. But if you don't take care of your homes, this is what happens to them and to your financial investment in them. In order for you to reach this week's $100,000 goal, we're all going to need to take a little trip. Everybody, on a bus. One. The votes were counted overnight, and the community has gathered to find out who they've chosen to receive $10,000. You have had a fantastic, fantastic week. You worked around the clock, sacrificing sleep, time with your families, to do what was seemingly impossible. You have earned the right to award one of your own with $10,000. Yeah. These people are putting themselves deeper and deeper into debt because of their addiction to vehicles. And it's time for an intervention. So right about now, you must be wondering how you will be getting around this week. We have another challenge for you. One that you all can participate in and that will help you reach your $100,000 goal. Thelma Kennedy, come on up. Woo! Ooh, are you ready to pop your balloon? Sure. What do you think is gonna be in there? Money, I hope. How much? <laughs> Any idea what your savings might be? A couple thousand dollars. Okay, here you go. Okay, hey, open this one. We know a lot of you have some questions and concerns, um, particularly those of you that have been working in the house over those two days. We've got Matt and Jason that are here from Urban Environmental that are here to answer any and all questions that people might have. Oh, okay. There you go. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> Did you think you could do it when you started? Uh, no. Crossing the finish line was a huge accomplishment for this community. But a few, like Charlissa, were still absent. Will it be enough to reach their goal? You gotta change your shirt. I have to change my shirt. To say, I know I can. Oh, oh. That's... I knew I could. Oh, I knew I could. There you go. 